Hey everybody, welcome to the video and thank you so much for joining me today. I'm gonna to be unbagging, not unboxing, I guess technically unbagging this special package from someone. It is a jersey. I mean, I know it's a jersey. I'm, I, it feels like a jersey and I was told it was a jersey. So 99.9% .9 this is a jersey. Uh, this was sent in by an actual fan of the channel and it is hand stitched or custom stitched by them. Actually, they do this on the side as a side business. So they said, Neil, look, listen, I'm a fan. I like your content. Um, would it be okay if I sent you some of my work for you to see? And if you have any blank jerseys in the future, um, feel free to send them to me and we can work out something. And I said, yeah, I mean, I'd be absolutely okay with, with checking out some of your work and stuff. And uh, yeah, he just, he sent this for free. Like I was expecting to ask, you, you know, he wanted to, hey, if you, send, you buy this from me, whatever, um, I can do something for you in the future, whatever, but he literally just sent this for free. So I really appreciate that, Bobby, you're the man. And I appreciate you just generally watching the channel. That really means a lot. So kind of a special unboxing here. I need to be careful, sorry, unbagging. I need to be careful opening up this and I don't want to go in too deep and cut something. So you packed it very well, Bobby. <laughs> I'm impressed actually. And I know, I know you guys won't see this until probably Friday or Saturday, but I'm actually filming this on a Wednesday and I think he s mailed it yesterday on a Tuesday. So holy crap. Professional packing job, Bobby. You get extra, you get extra points for that. I'm not done yet. I still gotta. Continue. All right. And like I said, I have no idea what jersey this is. So I should I? Eh, I'll let you guys see it before me. This is a true, a true reveal. I don't know what this is gonna be. Okay, ready? Okay. I have no idea what this is. Should I just haul it out? I don't, actually, I don't know what else is in here. Maybe this piece of paper. Can I feel any pieces of paper? All right, ready? Hold on, mind focus. Okay. Ooh, Colorado. Heck yeah, I'm down with that. I'm down with Colorado. Ooh. Starter. Oh, wow, with Sackick on the back. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Check this out. Hold on, I'll make sure it's in focus here. That should be in focus. Wow. Man, you get that patch on there and everything? Dang. Bobby, that's impressive. I don't see any loose threads, Bobby. I'm impressed. Well done. I'm going to show some close-up footage of this as well um, in this video so you guys can see it. But, I mean, this looks, I mean, honestly, top-notch. I'm not saying that because I just got it for free. Um, I'm giving a genuine opinion here. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. This is... Uh, kind of an odd jersey for me to get because it's so much nicer than the one I actually have, just a second. So I technically already do have this jersey here and it is starter. It is like identical to the jersey basically, except for this one's a medium. Um, my logo looks worse in worse condition than this one. And the, actually the entire jersey looks in worse condition than the one you sent. But the problem with mine is it says my name on it. And I promise you, I've never played for the, for the Colorado Avalanche. Also, with this is heat pressed on. I mean, look at that. So, uh, I got this back in the day as a kid. I uh, absolutely love the jersey, but it is technically, I consider it to be a jersey foul. Um, I'll never get rid of it. I love this jersey. But to have kind of this version of the jersey with an actual player on the back with the C on there, and then the, and then the Stanley Cup or Western Conference, Eastern Conference, uh, Stanley Cup champions, 1996, man. That is cool. This is this is a frame worthy jersey. Put this in a shadow box. Put it in the back of my set someday. Yeah, that's what this jersey is. Thank you. Sir. I just want to make sure that you. Oh, you did include something. I apologize. I completely apologize. Ooh, and some business cards. Jersey guy, custom sports jersey sewing. 
Any name, any number. Hold on, I need to turn this back on autofocus. There you go. It's got Facebook, looks to be Instagram, his numbers on there, an email. Oh, sorry, that wasn't Instagram, that was an email icon. My bad. Heck yeah, man, those, like, jersey aside, the, the, these, these cards feel awesome. That's a weird thing to get excited about. But uh, yeah, I really like these business cards, Bobby. Like legit. All right, let's read your letter here. Uh, Neil, I wanna thank you not only for accepting this gift. Okay, you never have to <laughs> thank anyone for accepting a, a gift. Uh, I need to thank you, I'm thank you so much. Uh, and also considering uh, me or any, for any customization in the future. But for everything you do on your channel, my son Zach and I watch all of your videos. I can't tell you how many times he'll flip through your channel waiting for new videos. Zach, hello, how you doing? And I appreciate that, thank you. It is a really great way for us to connect during these COVID times. I hope you find the Sackic jersey to be up to your standards. I did my best to make a complete replica of the jersey they wore during the 1996 finals. I got the patch idea from one of your more recent videos about wanting patches, etc. Yeah, I'm actually looking for um, 20, 18 patch, 2019 patch, and 2020 patch because I'm going to put it on the Stanley Cup winning jersey from every single one of those years. I've got the white Washington one. I don't have the St. Louis white one, and I don't have the Tampa Bay white one, but I do plan on getting those jerseys and putting the patch on those. So that's what he's referencing here. Uh, he said, figured this would help um, start, you, start you off on the right foot. That's this is literally, this is the first step in that kind of collection. I, it's going to be very difficult to go back through the years for example, in 2016, sorry, in 2017, the Pittsburgh Penguins switched, I believe, to their current jersey style, but it was still in a Reebok. So there was, and then in 2018 or the next season, they switched to Adidas. So there was only technically one year of that style of Reebok jersey from the Pittsburgh Penguins, if I'm correct. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. So to find the white version, I think it was the white version, of that jersey even if it's the dark version, it doesn't matter. From that specific year in Reebok is a very difficult thing to do. And maybe impossible. I haven't even looked. So um, going back through the years and trying to get the patch on all the winning jerseys is going to be a very difficult task for me to do. But it is, a, it is something I'm planning on doing in the next 20 years. Like I don't want all the stuff in the next week or two weeks or something like that. So um, I, I appreciate the start of this one, uh, Bobby. Thank you. I've included what the cost of the jersey would, would be for me to customize it. No, there is no price for this one. Just a sample of what my cost would be uh, for hand stitching a custom jersey. Good information to know. Um, I charge cost for kit, layered sewing, and cost of patch. No sewing cost on patch. Uh, for shipping, you pay to ship to me, I pay to ship back. I normally ship return FedEx. And like I said earlier, he shipped it yesterday and I got it today, so that was pretty quick. I uh, said, thanks again so much for everything. Keep, keep going strong, uh, Bobby and Zach. So here's some pricing down here. Uh, cost for customization on this specific jersey that I showed, the Colorado Avalanche Sackic jersey. Jersey number kit is $50, sewing rate is $30, and a patch was $15, so a total of $95. My cost for lay layered sewing is this. Single layer, uh, Toronto, Detroit, Dallas, $20. Double layer, New Jersey, Carolina, Vegas, $25. Triple layer, Pittsburgh, Tampa, $30. So there's some inf information for you guys. Uh, I also showed this card earlier. I'll show it again. If you want to reach out to Bobby, see if that's an option for you, and go from there. So, uh, Bobby and Zach, man, thank you guys so much for this jersey. I really appreciate that. I'm in the process of trying to source some shadow boxes that aren't two hundred dollars or something crazy. So I'm waiting for a bit of a sale um, at some local stores, stores here to get some shadow boxes because there's a couple of jerseys that I want to put uh, in those and mount them either in the background or just somewhere else in this room just to kind of help with the aesthetics of. Of the, or the vibe of the whole room. So thank you for this jersey. I really appreciate that. You did a wonderful job on this. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to, to see this up hanging somewhere. So I really appreciate this gift. Thank you so much. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. And I will be back at you real soon for another video. Adios.